Jim Cramer here, taking a trip from Wall Street to the DraftKings Sportsbook for this weekend's first end trend. Miami Dolphins won an easy game last week against the Bengals, but will they continue to overachieve while covering yet another point spread? The Dolphins are 9-3 against the spread in 2020. That's the best mark of any NFL team, and they're pacing further ahead of their preseason win total than any other team too. The Dolphins will face their toughest test of the season in Week 14, when the 11-1 Chiefs come to town. Most of the action is predictably on KC, but with the spread around just a touchdown, the Holmes versus Tua could be a closer game than many people would have expected. The Steelers finally lost the game last week, getting upset at home by the Washington football team. And as a result, they find themselves as underdogs going into the Bills, which is going to be a really, really fabulous game. The Steelers were actually favored when the line for this game opened. But there's been a big shift in odds following the results of the Monday night game when the Bills also won convincingly against the 49ers. Not only are the Steelers dogs for this game, they're also not getting much love from betters either. Sentiments have turned against Pittsburgh quickly, with a significant percentage of betters expecting Buffalo to hand them their second straight loss. Now, much of the focus the last few weeks has been on the NFC East, but the NFC West has had a pretty significant shakeup as well. The Rams overtook the Seahawks as divisional favorites after a week 13, in which the Seahawks lost at home to the Giants. But the Rams' margin increased even further after beating the Patriots on Thursday night. LA is now more than two to one favorite over Seattle to win the NFC West. Though these teams will meet in a pivotal game in week 16. The Seahawks should be able to secure an easy win over the Jets this week and pull back to even in the standings. But it's looking increasingly like that the Rams will be crowned NFC West champs for the third time in four years.